we are now going to hear from our treasurer. Ash, I've got to get his name right. I've been practicing. Ashokan Tangaraju. <laughs> He's going to give the financial report and uh, talk about introducing a membership plan. So Ashokan is originally from Tamil Nadu, India, and that is where he obtained two master's degrees, one in computer applications and one in business administration. In 2006, he moved to the United States and he currently lives in Brookfield, Wisconsin with his wife and two children. He is currently working as a service delivery manager for Infosys Technologies. And Ashokan also serves as president of Greater Milwaukee Tamil Sangam. So welcome. Uh, yeah, really looking to hear, hear this financial report. <laughs> Sounds good. Good evening to everyone. Um, there are a few people in their mornings there, so good morning to you. Um, thank you for having me. Um, thank you, Chris, for the opportunity uh, to provide to, to so as a treasurer here um, in the Peace360 organization. Um, thank you. <clears throat> I will go ahead and uh, uh, and go ahead and explain the uh, the income and expense statements that we that we did in the 2020. So most of you know <clears throat> that the we started the organization um, formally in the early early 2020s. Um, we started the financial part a little late. Uh, we we were um, attached to a bank somewhere around July, and from then onwards, from then onwards, um, we have track of uh, tracked all our all our financial statements. So if you look into this, um, <clears throat> we had our deposits starting um, from the July. So we had uh, deposits in our bank account uh, until yesterday uh, for close to $1,601. And we had PayPal donations of $11.09. And uh, <clears throat> we had a donation from Chris today uh, for the a mental health program for the next 12 months uh, for like $1,200. And I have added my share of $100 as a uh, as in good note to the organization. Um, so we have like $1,300, which, which was deposited today. And uh, we have Facebook donations um, in the last uh, few weeks. Thank you, Anjo, for uh, your donation of $100 for the mental health program. And we have like $50 from Ravi Shankar, of $100 from Angel, $50 from um, Leah, and another $50 from Kenosha. So we have donations, Facebook donations, that is um, close to $350. And if you look into the expenses, <clears throat> we have paid close to $94.44 for Zoom since July. And we have spent close to $660.25 for uh, the uh, website and the email services that we are, being, that we are using for Peace360. And we had a bank fees of $688.81 that we had to incur. And if you, if you look into all the expenses on the right, um, all these are the donations that has come from Chris. Thank you, Chris, for uh, your extended support, help, um, and also financially. So, I mean, I had to say this out. <laughs> the donations that we we have pulled into the organization is somewhere close, less than 500, and the rest of the amount has come from Chris, from his own pocket. Uh, appreciated efforts, Chris, for running an organization. Thank you very much. So when I expand, expand the... Uh, um, Closing balance as of now in the uh, for 2020, we have closed to two thousand two hundred and twelve dollars and nineteen cents as of today in bank, and we have PayPal balance which is eleven dollars and nine cents, which were mostly the testing donations that we did during uh, for setting up the account, and then we, as I said, we have a close three fifty dollars that's spending from Facebook. So as of today, we have close to $2,573.28 for the rest of the season until we have new donations that is coming in uh, for running this organization. So 
we ha- i mean like we have operational cost uh, so we had we need inflow of funds to make sure that we run this organization thank you um we know can you close this um and then yeah can you go to the next slide <clears throat> thank you so <clears throat> with great pride and of with uh, with the permission from the board um i would like to introduce um the membership plan that we can that we have proposed for the uh, for the organization as i said uh, like one minute back <clears throat> we had to run the organization smooth to overcome all the operational costs we have been running a uh, couple of programs the mental health program the uh, speaker box so we are incurring um, expenses on a monthly basis and that is adding at least close to close to 100 dollars that uh, uh, close to 100 dollars for mental health and then the zoom expenses uh, the uh, email expenses the website expenses so if you look into it we probably need close to 200 to 250 dollars every every month at least at least I'm not giving you the most it's, it's at least so <clears throat> i would like to introduce um or suggest that if you could have an annual membership of 25 dollars per month for all the members um and um, we know we have uh, some students and interns who are still um, uh, still looking for job and we know i mean we had to we have to think about them so this 25 dollars is for all the members but still if you think if you can um if you can uh, send out and uh, note that you are a student or an intern uh, probably to your leads if you are in a team and if it comes from them probably we can think about um either waving off or how much we could reduce but i would say at least a 5 dollars for every from every member as a minimum cost annually would um would definitely help us to have a commitment to the commitment and and dedication to the organizational goals so that's one thing which we are suggesting and if we could have this as of uh, january 1st 2021 that would be uh, helpful so this is a humble request from um from all of us from in the in the board to uh, get this into the get into the membership model and then and i definitely bet that we every one of us are going to get benefited in one or other way so the study for dollars is i don't think so it's an it's an um, it's a big number that uh, we could think of but if you think that you can you you have some questions or concerns or anything please let us know and then uh, one of us will be able to help in that <clears throat> so i have pretty much covered um, everything and mainly why we are trying to get a membership model is just to make sure that we have an count of active members in the organization and also we can try to understand what are their roles and how much they are trying to um, trying to get um, benefited um, and also how much they can try they can uh, uh, they can help the organization okay uh, vinod can you go to the next slide please okay questions if you have any questions just send it across um uh, to one of us and then um we will be happy to answer um, i know it's we are running out of time so i don't want to have a question and answer session at this point please feel free to send your questions and then we will be glad to answer in, in a day or mostly in a day thank you very much thank you everyone for the opportunity uh, for giving me the opportunity and thank you chris for having me on board Thank you all. Have a good rest of the evening. Thank you guys.